Yo, 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 what's going on, YouTube? It's Orta here, and we're rocking the Scumpy shirt today. I had to do the intro, I thought it was hilarious. Um, tomorrow starts the North America Regionals. I'm going to go over the bracket. The bracket was finally put out today. So I'm going to go over who I think is going to win. Um, it's actually pretty simple and standard. I, I don't see many upsets going on, so I was going to start off with it. Um, the first one was Optic Gang versus MFAM. MFAM is a, a Mexican team. I can see Optic beating them, obviously. And moving on, um, Echo versus XGN, that could be a pretty good match. That can go either way. Um, if I had to pick one, though, XGN definitely um, would be the one I'd choose. Um, they're pretty good. And plus, I'm a huge fan of Rizman and Bubbles. I've played with them before. They're pretty good. Um, Strictly Business versus Boreal Esports, they're from Canada. Um, I, know, I don't know too much about them, so I can definitely see SB winning. Um, Caliber versus Bittersweet, again, it's another random American team that kind of just qualified through um, the online qualifier on the Day 2 one. Definitely see Caliber winning. Envious versus Fatal Ambitions. They're from Canada. I see Envy winning. Again, I don't see many upsets right now. Um, the next one is Threes Up Enterprises versus Orbit. That can go either way. Um, I, or Orbit is um, Twiz's team with Sinful. And then Threes Up, um, I know the um, owner of Threes Up. Well, I don't really know him, but I know one of them. I know a couple of the CEOs and stuff. They're a pretty good team. Um, like, but like, the team's pretty good. So, that, again, that can go either way. Um, ISO versus AR, another one that can go either way. Um, not really sure who would win, depends on who wins their first map, I believe. Um, got Gurus, uh, that's another one of the teams I don't really know about them, that qualify against Prophecy, definitely see Prophecy winning. You got Denial Esports versus uh, Aztec Gaming. Aztec Gaming has been a catch champs two years in a row. Um, shouldn't take them lightly, but um, going against Denial, I definitely see Denial moving forward into that bracket. Um, you got Fear versus Revenge. Um, that's one of those teams I could think go either way. If I had to pick one, it would be Fear. Um, that's it. That's the roster with Assassin, and I, oh, let me look it up. I had the rosters uh, saved as well. Let me scroll through this a little thing. Fear, yeah, it's Assassin and Trev and them. Um, again, that can go either way. And I, who did I say they're playing against? Uh, Revenge. I uh, don't know. Let me see who's on Revenge real quick before I get make my decision. Oh, that's Naga fan and Facento. Okay, I, I take that back. I see I see um, Revenge winning because I that's a... Uh, I got it mixed up from last year's uh, Revenge team. This is Aqua, Facento, Remy, and Nagafan. I definitely see them winning um, for sure then. Next up is Rise versus Vex. Um, that, that can be a close one go either way. Um, I probably would pick Rise, though. Um, I think Rise would be the stronger team. Legacy versus Phase Black. Phase Black for sure. Um, Stunner versus Levitate. Stunner. Um, Relapse versus Optic Nation. Optic Nation. Um, Below Zero versus Exertus. Exertus is a, a Canada team that has Realize on it. Realize is an American player. He decided to play with three Canadians and qualified through that because no one wanted to team with him, apparently. Um, it's not really a sneak diss at Realize, but I, I just thought it was funny. A lot of people were actually remember tw on Twitter roasting him for doing that. But hey, whatever it takes to get to champs. Not going to judge him. Honestly, if I was in his shoes, I would have done the same thing. Um, but, I mean, my team's all American, 2 East, 2 West, whatever. I wouldn't, like, s fucking sketch on them anyway. Um, but, yeah, I, I, I can see Exertus winning. Um, I'm not really sure who's on below zero. Let me look that up real quick. Uh, doesn't, I don't see them, hold on, what, I'm like totally doing this on the fly right now, I'm sorry, where is below zero, at? below zero, below zero, echo, okay, that's rep and wolf, okay, wolf's on there, um, I, I don't know, that can go either way, I don't really see either, the, either of them getting further than the, that round anyway, to be honest, um, then you got, the last but not least, Gravity versus Phase Red. Definitely see Phase Red going forward. Um, like I said, I know this video seems very biased towards the pro teams, but I, I just don't see any surprises happening. I mean, you never know. It could happen. But the likeliness, in my opinion, is not going to happen. Um, again, for those of you who don't know, it's, it's, it's a double elimination bracket. 32 teams are going there. Only 14 of them are going to champs, though. Um, if I had to pick 14 teams to go to champs, though, I mean... Just by looking at the bracket and like who has to play who, I mean I could see Optic Gaming, you know, uh, op, like just looking at it, like I said Optic Gaming maybe, uh, Caliber, Envy, AR, Prophecy, um, Denial, uh, Rise, both phases, Optic Nation, Stunner, and then whoever just fills in the gap just kind of 